Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another review for Matt Allen of Freak Show Designs located down in Orlando, Florida. Now this is another one of his sideshow sauces and I'm really excited about this one because I just really love a Louisiana style hot sauce and that's exactly what this one is. Just check this out. Sideshow sauces, voodoo juice. Check out that awesome label. All right, that is very, very cool. A Louisiana style hot sauce. Now make sure you check out my first review that I did to get a little bit more information about Matt and his company. Check out that first review that I did for Vamp Slayer. If you love garlic, you've got to check that one out. All right, let's go ahead and get into this one. It says a classic Louisiana style hot sauce made with an infusion of traditional Creole and Cajun spices and flavors. Boy, that sounds good. All right, now here's what it uh, here's the ingredients on this one. I got to read it from my phone. Uh, this one's got 80 milligrams of sodium, which is great. Not too high, not too low. And we start off with white vinegar, cayenne pepper, sea salt. Now that's really all you need for a Louisiana style uh, pepper sauce, right? Uh, uh, cayenne peppers, vinegar, and salt. But this one does so much more. And uh, now he adds paprika, garlic, onion, basil white pepper, black pepper, thyme, oregano, and xanthan gum. So that is just awesome. Now this is a little bit thicker than a really thin based Louisiana style sauce, which I love. I love Tabasco. <clears throat> I love Crystal. They have their places. They have their uses. Uh, but sometimes uh, you want a little bit more than just your basic cayenne pepper flavor, vinegar, and salt. A lot of them are just too darn salty. Um, but uh, sometimes you want something a little bit more, and this is this one delivers with some spices. Check that out. So it's slightly thicker uh, than a <clears throat> Louisiana style, you know, vinegar-based pepper sauce. A little bit thicker, but not too thick. All right, and it does not come with a flow restrictor. All right, here we go. Let's smell this. Okay, just an awesome aroma on this one, guys. The first thing it hits you is those spi this is that spice blend. Just an awesome blend. You get the tartness from the vinegar. You get a little bit of that cayenne pepper, uh, you know, that traditional type aroma from a, a Louisiana style hot sauce that's made with uh, cayenne peppers. Not too vinegary, but you just get a really just a bouquet. This is there's there's an herbal essence going on with what's in here. Um, so you're getting that really nice blend, and that's exactly what is really <clears throat> made up of a Creole. Cage and I think Creole is a little bit more. Um, they use a little bit more herbs in a in a Creole seasoning, but the Cajun Creole seasoning blend with that garlic, paprika, onion, basil. I can smell the thyme a little bit, so it's got a nice um, <clears throat> green, uh, minty, very aromatic type aroma to it. Just amazing, really, really nice aroma. All right, really something different. Okay, to show you what this one looks like. Look at that. Pours really nice. Not too thick, not too thin either. Just right. Here we go. Mm. Wow, this is a flavor bomb. So much more than just cayenne peppers, vinegar, and salt. Um, you're just getting a real nice, rich spiciness from the herbs and the spices that are in here. You really get that Creole Cajun uh, type aroma. This is really a flavor bomb. So if you love a simple basic red pepper sauce, like a Louisiana style sauce, but sometimes you think they're too vinegary, sometimes they're too salty, and you just want something a little bit more, this one delivers big time, guys. Really, really good. This takes a Louisiana style hot sauce and really elevates it to a, a gourmet level. Uh, with that spice blend in here. Very well done, Matt. All right, now what do you do with a type of sauce like this? Well, I have just got to put this on my my breakfast, and I cooked up two fried eggs, some Geechee Boy Mill stone ground grits, the best, from South Carolina, and some Jimmy Dean sausage patties, and just went to town on that breakfast. It was just amazing. Really, really good. So this is my second review for Sideshow Sauces, and I'm impressed, guys. These are really, really good. Now, don't think that because of these labels, these are gimmicky um, type hot sauces with no flavor. They are not. They've got these awesome 
uh, horror type theme labels, but they, it's gourmet in the bottle. These are very well done, handcrafted, all made by hand, small batch right there in Orlando, Florida. So highly recommend it. Check them out. I'll put the link down in the description. Okay, Matt, thank you so much for sending it. I do appreciate it. Guys, stay tuned for more from Sideshow Sauces. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.